Is this thing on, man? Hello? Hey. Hello. Okay. This thing's giving, man. The name of this video should be It's Be Thankful. You know, I wanted to talk to you guys about a touchy subject, especially with Christ. And uh, how Christ has uh, obviously blessed you to be able to make it to this day. Um, I think that's a big big deal that no one really thinks about is how much you're blessed to make it to Thanksgiving because recently I don't like to say it a lot and talk about my personal life on here a lot because a lot of people honestly don't care you know real real junk a lot of people don't care you know but why I'm dragging my Celsius I tend to talk to you guys so that's just the way I do it on this channel but basically a lot of people don't care a lot of people don't they don't they don't really think about Thanksgiving and the impact it makes well let me just say this Thanksgiving let me talk about my personal life like I was gonna say um, my uncle is slowly p passing away okay he's seven percent of his heart works right now and um you know you don't realize how much of a blessing it is for someone to make it to this day until they make it to this day and you see them smiling and through the pain and everything they suffer you know and um man i prayed for him to get redeemed by god and he has recently actually so you know that's what matters to me is the fact that he has recently woken up to god and you know a lot of people don't get that chance a lot of people die instantly you know a lot of people don't get that little countdown that he got you know no offense to him he's not a countdown on life i'm just saying no one no one gets the chance that he got just to like push it further and further back you know they you know what i'm saying like no one gets them chances so you gotta really be thankful for that and um there's a lot of verses in the bible that recommend and say things about thankfulness but here's one in 2 Corinthians 4.14. All this for your benefit, so that the grace that is reaching more and more people may cause thanksgiving to overflow to the glory of... Hold on. I got to read the rest. Got to find her. Man, hold on. My phone's lagging for some reason. Glory of God. And there's another one that I wanted to read to y'all. Tessa, I can't really say it. Tessa Lion something. 5, 16, 18. Rejoice, always pray, continually give thanks in all circumstances. For this is God's will for you in Christ Jesus. Now, that's a powerful verse. And a lot of people don't recognize that verse. But, see, a lot of people go out there and street preach. And I want to do that one day. I want to be able to do that. But right now, I gotta learn everything. You know, I gotta learn what I can about the Bible, and and honestly, I think this is my calling. My calling is to talk to you guys through my fitness, of uh, my faith in Christ. And honestly, when I work out, I feel closer to Christ because God gives me the strength to lift the heavy weight. God gives me the strength to look like I do. God gives me the strength to push past my limits man you got to give all glory to god that's what i'm saying and uh thankfulness man thankfulness be thankful man because a lot of people don't even want to ain't even gonna listen to this conversation they're gonna skip to the workout and the montage but the people who stayed man you guys are actually trying to learn and learn what god is trying to tell tell y'all through me so i do thank y'all for staying and um you know i just want to say you know it's back day it's back day, so we're gonna go in there, have Christ by our side, and uh, I hope you guys and girls, you know, you never know, 1% of my uh, viewers is females, so. I'm just saying, uh, but basically, we're gonna go in there, we're gonna lift some weights, and uh, my brothers and sisters in Christ, I hope you learned something from this conversation and you gain and teach it to somebody else so they can keep spreading. We're trying to spread the gospel. Um, and um, amen. 
I hope everybody out there had a good Thanksgiving and I hope everybody out there recognize how thankful they should be for their family members and everything that, that you know, they do. So we're gonna go in there, we're gonna hit back, biceps, maybe some shoulders, because last night I came here and I hit shoulders a little bit, but I didn't really hit it hard because, you know, I was tired, I got off of work. We're on the holidays right now at work, so I'm okay right now, man. I'm ready to get in there. And a lot of people call me crazy. Like my nanny just called, my nanny didn't call me crazy, but she's like, dang, you're going to the gym, it's Thanksgiving. Man, listen, this is how I, I spent, you know, talking to them and all that today. And now I'm in the gym. This is my alone time with Christ, in my opinion. This is my alone time with y'all and Christ. And this is how I express myself, through these weights, through this. It's just the person I am. And it can sound corny, it can sound everything. But man, like, I'm thankful for the gym, for how it's changed my life. I'm also thankful for my family. But most importantly, I'm thankful for God. So, you know, I'm in here because my dedication and hard work makes me feel good. And this makes me feel good. So, if anybody calling you crazy, listen. God said, you know, I, if I'm misquoting it, please correct me in the comments, but the world hated him first. Remember that. The world did hate him first. So, remember, he put me in this world, but we do not belong to this world. So, let's celebrate the little things. Be thankful. And uh, let's go hit this back and biceps and a little bit of shoulders. And um, I just want to say there's no one else here. So, you know, we might get a little, a little shirt off session. Because, uh, it did maybe. Sharing each other, and there isn't all the 